My life view was simple. One, I just wanted to be a happy person with happy thoughts. Two, we were all a simple action away from complete disaster. You hear that? Yes, I did. Is that bad? I knew it. I've somehow gone crazy. Dysphoric is when you just don't feel right in your own skin. I was now living in some kind of horrific, perpetual dream state. Are you okay? What do I do? Tell me what to do. It's important that you socialize. You know, I've seen you before at a party, and this dog came up to you. You fed a potato chip. chip. I was wondering if you wanted to get together. You and me? Uh-huh. My God, she was fantastic. Let's go there. I couldn't hide my condition from her forever. If I had any real chance with Sarah, I had to speed up my recovery. Go on. So I went with another doctor who specialized in a big word, which meant take drugs. We'll begin with an antipsychotic. Psychotic? I'm, I'm psychotic? The fact that you're asking the question proves that you're not. Have you taken an antipsychotic before? No, I'm not psychotic. I already asked if I was psychotic, and apparently that proves that I'm not psychotic. So how's your attachment thing? You could jam this fork into my eye socket right now, and I wouldn't feel it. And I'm really going to need you to put down that fork. Permanent twitching of the facial muscles. What the hell? You just need to stop being so... What? Negative. Is there a Mr. Dr. Blaine? I don't think that's really important to your treatment. <laughs> Have any of you guys ever slept with a patient? I love you! That is so wrong. Yeah. I would never let a girl go to my shrink. She knows too much about you now. You want to end this? What if this is the way I'm going to be for the rest of my life? Come on, tell me it's over. No, I suggest you try to accept it. Good luck with this one, Hudson. Thanks, Rick. You don't have to save me, Sarah. But I am going to love you for the rest of my life, so things will be a lot better for me if you are around.